All right, let's get ready to rock and roll. We got another taste test on the way, and I went out mini golfing on Saturday, of course. I didn't win, but Mike uh, was a good opponent. I, uh, I'm i getting better. I'm getting better. I want to get out and play more mini golf, of course. But before Mike uh, played, he gave me three cans of soda. So this is the first of the three cans he gave me. It's called A Treat. I've seen these before. These are not like the uh, high level, a uh, high type of brand soda. These are more like the type you find like at a dollar store or something like that. But you know, a good soda can be found anywhere. So the the Fagos are popular at dollar stores, and I like the Fagos. So if you're watching on Barstool, I'm gonna include a replay of my live stream golf. You can watch that as you watch. My latest taste test is all natural and natural and artificial. My brain, my brain, my brain's in a blender. My brain's in a blender. I almost said that. I actually literally almost said that. But this is a company from Orfield, Pennsylvania. A treat black cherry soda. You know I'm particularly fond of black cherry soda. Especially Doc Brown's black cherry soda, which is the best black cherry soda you can get. But we're gonna give this a try and see how it measures up. Brand I gotta wash all my metal straws by the way. So I'm left with a plastic one today. Ben and boom 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 Hmm. It's a smooth cherry. It almost tastes like a maraschino cherry. You know, maraschino cherry. It's like a. <coughs> Well, more like a cherry cordial, I would say. Yeah, more like a cherry cordial. That's what I meant to say. Not maraschino cherry. Cherry cordial. That you have on, like, the uh, chocolate-covered cherries. Not a bad taste. I'm going to give this a 6.7. Above average... Not over the moon. <laughs> 